In the wake of the deadly mass shooting at Appalachie High School in Georgia, mental health experts say it's critical that those who encountered loss get the help they need. But while offering support to every person experiencing grief can be vital to their emotional recovery, when it comes to students in college, dealing with the loss of a loved one can be intense for them to manage, with so many changing environments. It's leading some psychologists to call for the creation of new policies. Chris DeMeo takes a closer look at the recommendations. Processing the death of a loved one can be difficult no matter how old you are, but for college students away at school, it can be even more overwhelming to handle that kind of grief, especially if individuals are far removed from their familiar support networks. Within any one year period, 25 to 30 percent of college students are grieving the death of someone close to them. Because grief can be so common across college campuses, some psychology experts caution how the strong emotional responses to loss can interfere with a student's ability to juggle intensive academic responsibilities. So they're trying to simultaneously stay cognitively, socially focused on campus while they're also trying to grieve and be in connection with their families. But while most colleges offer mental health services, Dr. Heather Servati Saib of Purdue University recommends that institutions offer bereavement leave policies for students. For a student to have the, the assurance that for their instructors, you know, to know and, and to be um, aligned and, and aware of a policy that gives students a certain number of days to be able to make up work without any kind of negative consequences, it's crucial. This while also advocating for the formation of grief groups to help foster deeper connections. That sense of isolation can be so decreased, it can make a huge difference to have a community within which you can share your grief in a very open kind of way and not have to filter. Chris DeMeo, Fox News.